vision problems can happen to pretty much anyone, even rock stars. And Dr. Philip Hopes is here to talk about the procedure he performed on our local rock star, Graham Russell from Air Supply. I think it's the first time you've not been singing on our show. It is, I think, yeah. Feels weird. <laughs> you may have to belt out a tune <laughs> right at the end just to make everybody happy. Okay, so tell us the vision problems that you were having before you saw Dr. Hoops. Well, my optometrist in uh, Park City said that I had cataracts, which I knew I had, and he said that they're steadily they're going to get worse. And he said, uh, uh, would I think about getting surgery? And I, went, I hadn't thought about it then, but uh, he put me in touch with Dr. Hoops, and the rest is history. I went down there and, and he gave me a great examination and said, uh, he confirmed his suspicions and said, yeah, why don't I get it done? So I had it done, you know. How common is this for someone like Graham to have cataracts? Well, cataracts are very common. In fact, it's one of the more common surgical procedures performed in the United States. You know, we typically wait until the vision is beginning to become problematic for the patient. So things that they might do on a day-to-day -day basis uh, seem to be more difficult, more problematic. Um, in his case, uh, now is a great time to get cataract surgery because the technology is improving. When we did cataract surgery, you know, as little as five to ten years ago, all patients had to have bifocal glasses afterwards. But now with some new technology and the technology mm. we used in Graham uh, called a Technus multifocal implant, these patients are seeing far, they're seeing near, and you could probably tell us how the vision has been the last oh, month or two. So oh. that was the procedure. What happened right after? Um, Right after I went home, you know, about 15 minutes afterwards, and it was so simple, you know. In fact, the second one I fell asleep. Remember that? <laughs> I, I wanted to be awake, but I fell asleep. But, no um, way! Yeah, I did. Yeah, but it only takes 15 minutes, doesn't it? Yeah. Very well, you have to be able to see your fans. I do. Out there and give them a wave and. Absolutely. But I, I, I used to have glasses, but I don't have glasses anymore. And. Uh, and, and I would recommend someone that's thinking of having cataract surgery should go and have it because it's so simple and. And I can see anything now, far and near, you know. That's amazing. Okay, so if, how do you know if you have cataracts? I mean, do you need to go see someone, see a doctor, see you to see, know if you have them? And what would be the symptoms of that? Well, symptoms of a cataract include, obviously, blurry vision, both, you know, without your glasses on or with your glasses on. Um, a lot of people think it's only an age problem, but we've had patients as young as in their 20s this year with cataracts. So if you suspect your vision is not as good as it could be, it's worth coming in for an examination. Now, is that genetic, or is Graham like staring into the sun, or wh how, why did he have cataracts? You know, there's so many reasons genetics does play a role. Um, injury plays a role, medications play a role. I suspect, you know, you might have had yours longer than you think the way they looked. Um, mm. And the truth mm. is, if we all are around long enough, we'll have cataracts. So is your wife looking better to you now? You can see better? Yeah, I can see it now. He's a really, really pretty wife, so I bet you're like, hey, <laughs> you're and you, kind. hi there. <laughs> Good to see you. Okay, so some of the other things that you're doing at, at Hoops, because you do LASIK, you do a bunch of different things to help people's vision. Well, you know, there's at this point in time a solution for almost everyone's vision problem, whether or not it's just simply getting out of contacts, whether they need help with cataracts. It's a great time to be an eye doctor because we have so many things at our disposal to use on patients. So it's worth coming in and taking a look. Mm -hmm. Well, and you want to see the best. Dr. Hoops is the best. That's why Graham Russell went right. to him. I know. When, when can people get this? Can they get this right oh, now? Oh, it's that. It's every Best Buy everywhere. Yeah. Best Buy? Yeah. Um, what's your favorite song on this album? Uh, my favorite song is uh, Can I Be Your Lover. Can I Be Your Lover. Yeah. Okay. Wonderful. I'm excited. I, like, I'm so excited that you brought this and... And I can see all of these things. I don't have cataracts yet, but who I can knows? See LASIK might be around the corner. <laughs> <laughs> Graham, great to see you. Glad your vision's doing well. It's great. Dr. Hoops, thank you for coming on and talking thank about you. this. Okay, Dr. Hoops, you can go to our website to find out more information. But um, hoopsvision.com, 801-568-0200 if you want more information. All right, coming up next, we are making Neater's 4th of July cupcakes. You want this recipe.